Thank you, Mrs. Tudor, for receiving me. If you knew how I was looking forward to this moment. And now you're probably disappointed. Oh, Mrs. Tudor. Oh, please sit down. Thank you. Oh, so you're the gentleman that sent me those lovely flowers. Thank you. You Somehow I pictured you quite differently as a dignified old gentleman. And now I see you, I... I wonder if it was really the right thing to ask you back here. You, you see, I never see strangers in my dressing room. Oh, but you're no stranger to me, Mrs. Tura. I've seen you in everything you ever played. I'll never forget how I laughed when I saw you as Kiki. Yes, <laughs> some people thought I was funny. <laughs> but you certainly weren't funny when you played Lady Macbeth. Thank you. I was really scared of you that night. Oh, poor little me. Oh, I wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> <laughs> or a goldfish. By the way, how is he? Who? The goldfish. What goldfish? Oh, the one you're so attached to. You see, I, I read all your interviews. Oh, oh yes. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> and when I saw that picture of you in the farm, you behind the plow. <laughs> By the way, where was that? In the Chronicle. Oh, no, I mean, where's the farm? Oh, no, no, no. I think we've talked much too much about me. Tell me about yourself. Well, uh, there isn't much to tell. I, uh, I just fly a bomber. Oh, how perfectly thrilling. I don't know about its being thrilling, but it's quite a bomber. You might not believe it, but I can drop three tons of dynamite in two minutes. Really? Does that interest you? It certainly does. I don't want to overstep myself, but I'll take a chance. Would you permit me to show you my plane? Maybe. When shall I call for you? Tomorrow at 2 o'clock at my home. No, I'd better meet you right at the airport. Goodbye. Mm. I hope you forgive me if I acted a little clumsy, but this is the first time I ever met an actress. Lieutenant, this is the first time I've ever met a man who could drop three tons of dynamite in two minutes. Bye. Bye. <laughs>